All right. All right, hey guys. Uh, over the past like couple weeks, I've been like really getting into like uh, film photography. And uh, this is the camera I picked up from like a thrift store, antique store. I got this for like $45. And I've already, div I, I bought like $300, 300 more or more dollars worth of stuff to start developing film and like scanning it. I bought this Epson V600 off of eBay for like 150 bucks. And um, I already started developing film and uh, I'm gonna um, use my last black and white roll to um, take some pictures. It looks semi-decent outside. I don't know if it's just white for you, but it's got some blue, a little cloudy. Um, so yeah, let's let's uh, let's load this up and then we'll go. So. Okay, well, I had to reopen it, so I ruined some of the film, but it should be fine. All right, so we decided to go to um, uh, Jericho, the place from last video. But uh, yeah, so we, we were kind of cutting close on time, and I've already taken a couple pictures. Um, I will probably take most of the pictures here today. Like over here kind of looks nice and like over here kind of like that so uh yeah we'll take some pictures with my camera can you see inside here hold on let me, let me see oh yeah you can my light meter doesn't work but um yeah all right so let's take a picture of this over here um I put the film at like half box speed, so it was 400 film, and I'm overexposing it to um, for 200 ISO. So hopefully, hopefully the pictures come out less um, dark than my last um, thing, because they did come out very dark on my first go at this. We'll see the results of that picture when I start developing them or I could add it in the video like here you go hola I'm gonna walk down this trail over here I don't know I'm actually gonna try to take a picture of some of this um, stuff. Alright, so we took a picture of that right there. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna go over here. You think this would be a good picture? Maybe. I could probably take a picture of this. Yeah. We're gonna do this at 3.5 at half box speed. Okay, we just took a picture of this over here. All right, I took a picture of over here, over here, and then I took a picture of my family eating blueberries, and then I also took a picture like this with blueberries in my hand. But yeah. They mowed all this. Go over there. There's a huge look at that thing! Is that an eagle? Oh no, it's a it's a um let's go over there. Come on. Crane. Hold on, let me take a picture okay. of this. Alright, let's go try to yeah, let's go try to go over to that. Or we have to be quiet though. 
There's a grasshopper. Oh, oh. no. Where is it? Oh, for right there. Oh, whoa, that thing has a long neck. Slow. Don't really see it any. Oh, yeah. I don't know if you guys can see that, but. It's like right down there. I think those things are eating the fish, right? Shh. Better walk slow. Don't walk. Whoa. I can't take a picture from here. That is pretty awesome. Alright, so just been walking around taking pictures and stuff, trying to get this roll done. I got uh, like four or five pictures left, but uh, we'll see. Um, let me count them. Am I loaded on this one? Yeah, I'm loaded, so probably like five pictures left. But we're gonna develop it either tonight or tomorrow morning, depending on what I'm doing, because I might be going to my to see some friends. I kinda wanna get a picture of this. Okay. Yeah, this is the beach. Maybe we can find something to take a picture of over here. Oh, is this? So this is what they sweep the beach with. I'm gonna try to put the camera right here and I'm gonna hang upside down on this and there's like a timer thing right here so I'm gonna try to use that don't know exactly know how to use it but hopefully I don't you know do anything stupid right there okay. alright oh, that's good Hopefully that was good, I don't know, but, I don't know. Alright, so, I took all the pictures in my camera. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna wind up the film, so, I put it to the bolt in, yeah, and then you just wind it up. Did I? I left it a little bit exposed. That's perfect. So I didn't really take film much of the picture taking, but um, yeah, when we get home or whenever you see me next, I will be developing the film. This is going to be my second time ever um, developing film. Um, I got my developer, my stop, and my fixer. And I got some measuring thingies. I got my Patterson Tink. And a temp thing. Some scissors. And then the actual rolls in my pocket. Um, but yeah. I got, um, I have this on the window. Um, this is panda film or something, um, it's kind of meant for, like, this kind of stuff, I think, so, um, if you look, 
I don't know if you can see the door, but the only the light that comes through is the door. That's all I have to do is cover the door. We should be good. We should be good. We should be good. I will come back when this is loaded. Also, this is what I'm going to be using to open the film roll. <sighs> you know, I'm still new, so uh, it took me about like 10 minutes in the dark just trying to like figure out how to, um, you know, get it on the spool. But, you know, I eventually figured it out. Um, I think. Lens this. Okay, I'm gonna, uh, we're gonna dump the developer out and we're gonna pour some stop. All right, we're pouring it out. I could probably rinse this actually with some water first before I throw some stop in there. Pop that out. All right, 500 milliliters of this. dump this back in here and this will go in for um, five to ten minutes okay so now we are just rinsing it with water just drinking some coffee as a weight so uh, Yep. It's a moment of truth. All right, I see pictures, I think. I changed my mind, I'm gonna hang it up in my room. Yep. All right, I just hung up the pictures and I'm already seeing some pretty decent pictures. My hand with blueberries, boobs. A couple pictures of me and my brothers, maybe my dad. And yeah. We'll get them scanned after this drives and my coffee.